Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today, we are going to talk about Dolly Parton and Beyonce. Dolly Parton and Beyonce. If you missed the news, Beyonce did a cover, did her own version of Dolly Parton's Jolene. I like Dolly. I like covers. So a whole bunch of y'all sent me messages about it with links asking me if I'd seen it and what I thought of it. And all of them, except for one, because there's always one, <laughs> were very lighthearted and fun. The one that uh, wasn't fun said, uh, can you please explain to me how this is not cultural appropriation with a link to it? Okay, because we're just not going to let anybody enjoy anything, I guess. Um, first, there's a difference between cultural appropriation, appreciation, and exchange. Those are different things. But let's be real. The person who sent this, they don't care about any of that. They have a perceived gotcha that they want to explore. Okay, so we can do that. If you were to pursue that line of reasoning, you would first probably want to know what Dolly thought of it, right? That would be your your number one source. And Dolly is a person who was totally cool with this exact same dynamic decades ago. Because in case you don't know, super fan, uh, Whitney Houston's I Will Always Love You is a Dolly Parton song. The other thing is you would want to look at the other things that Dolly has done. Um, because in case you don't know, she is not on your team, okay? Like, not at all. Um, you're talking about a woman who, when she found out that this thing at Dollywood called Dixie Stampede, and if you don't know, the, the origin of the word Dixie actually isn't racist, but she found out that some people perceived it that way. She did not scream my heritage or anything like that. She changed the name. She is not on your side. Now, as far as Beyonce, I think she's fantastic and beautiful. And I love her music. And that quote goes on. I would just love to hear Jolene done in just a big way. Kind of like how Whitney did my I Will Always Love You. Someone that could take my little songs and make them like powerhouses. That would be a marvelous day in my life if she ever does Jolene. That is a quote from Dolly Parton talking about the idea of Beyonce doing a cover of Jolene from years ago. She actually wanted the cover made. Um, and since it came out, she's actually released like a little message that certainly seems to indicate that she likes it. So there's that. Now, one of the big problems with gotchas like this is that they distract from real criticisms because there's an issue with this song and it's a big one and it has bothered me since before Beyonce ever did hers but Beyonce's just reinforced the problem. To understand it, you have to go back in history a little bit. Type in 1973 Dolly Parton. Click images. Now type in Beyonce and click images. This song would have us, the listener, believe that somewhere out there, there's a woman that is going to make both of them feel insecure. What is Jolene supposed to look like? Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.